happens and you get a massive cut. Well, you can use stitches, which hurt like hell. Or you can use this new alternative called hydrogel. That sticks, fills, and encourages tissues to grow in gaps on your wound, even heals patients twice as fast as stitches and hurts much less. It's science and it's the future of personalized healthcare. Here's how it works. If we zoom in on hydrogels at the molecular level, we'd find that it's made up of repeating units called monomers. These monomers represent molecules. Molecules are like ingredients in a recipe, which we can use to make anything. Just like how an egg is different than flour, different molecules have different characteristics, hence we can use them for different purposes. For example, you can have molecules that are afraid of water. Like if you put oil in water, it bunches up to avoid water. Quite contrastingly, you can have molecules that love water. I love water! And these molecules combine together to form what's called a polymer strand. Just by changing one molecule on your strand, you can change the entire property of your material. Now you may be asking yourself, what's so special that hydrogels are polymers? I mean, plastic, polyester in your clothing, protein in your food are all polymers. Well, to that I say hydrogels are made up of 3D polymers. Instead of one mere strand, it is made up of multiple strands intertwined together like a net. This net-like structure provides hydrogel with the super absorbent power like a sponge. And that's because molecules from these polymer strands love water. So they act as magnets towards water. And the physical shape of this net makes it easier to trap water. Why? Imagine if you were being chased by lions. It's much easier to run away from one lion compared to a pack of lions that surround you. That's the same thing with the net structure that traps water molecules in its holes. But hold up. I'm not trying to question their love, but... Why do they attract? That's because both are polar. Polar molecules are made up of atoms connected by sharing negative electrons. But as we all know, when we share things, there's always that one person that gets more. Same thing for polar molecules. The atoms with a stronger desire for the electron will pull the electron closer to them, making their side slightly negative and the other side slightly positive. Because opposite charges attract, the slightly positive side of a molecule will attract the slightly negative side of any other polar molecule, like a hydrogel molecule, as to a water molecule. What this means is that hydrogel is not only attracted to water, but other types of polar molecules like hydrophilic drugs, which we can use this property for drug delivery to target certain areas of our body. By using hydrogels to absorb hydrophilic drugs, then the patient can orally eat this hydrogel. And we can control where it travels, increasing accuracy, and reducing side effects experienced today. Right now, hydrogel can be found in commercial products like your contact lenses or diapers. Yet, the future is near where the next time you get an injury, you might not even need stitches at all.